Today, I'm going to show you how you can generate AI videos in any language with automatic captions, unique B-rolls to fill out your video, and a personal video editing space to fine-tune any of your generated videos. It's as simple as thinking of an idea for a video and then putting that idea on paper, or in this case, online, and with a click of a button, you've generated a video with either your own voice, which can be changed to speak any language shown on the screen, or you can use their AI options, which can also do the same thing. Esploriamo insieme e troviamo la tua prossima meta da sogno. Yep, that is me speaking in Italian, and I'm far from fluent in Italian. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. For starting off, you want to go ahead and create an account. Now, if you did want to follow along with me, there will be a link in the description down below. Now, once you've signed up, you should be taken to the same area as me, where you can, of course, start to generate a video. And before we do decide to do anything, you want to go ahead in the top right and click your profile and then go ahead and click settings and then we want to go ahead and check the beta features area so you want to go ahead and turn this on so what this allows is you get to use the experimental new features which really does help and then if it already isn't set to version 2.0 you want to go ahead and click the model and go to 2.0 like so so the first thing we need to do is input a script so as you can see here it says give me a topic language and detailed instructions now you can get very specific with what you want in video AI to generate. Now, if you weren't sure with what you wanted to go ahead and put in, you can go ahead and look at the workflows and plugins area and click explore all. And then you can decide to choose which workflow you kind of want to aim for. So if you were just simply going for a video explaining on YouTube, you can choose this option or a scripted video. There's a lot you can choose between here. Now I do already have a script, but before I go ahead and put in my script, you do have the option to clone your voice and use your voice within your script. Now, this is a paid feature so do keep that in mind but i'm going to go ahead and add this so i can go ahead and click clone your voice and then as you can see i've already added my voice so nvidia ai can now use my voice to go ahead and say anything that is said within my script to simply add your own voice of course again you do need a paid plan but you want to go ahead and click add voice and then all you need to do is submit a recording of at least 30 seconds and within that recording, you need to go ahead and mention, I give NVIDIA the permission to use my voice within this workspace. Pretty simple stuff. And within your audio script, you do want to go ahead and just speak how you normally would. And while you are recording, you do want it to be somewhat high quality. This doesn't matter too much. It doesn't have to be prestige quality. Then of course, you can go ahead and drop the file here. And then you'll have your voice. As you can see here, mine is called Jack's voice, which is me. And then I can go ahead and click use. And then it'll take me back to this page where it's gone ahead and put in a command. So now when I go ahead and input my script, it's going to use my voice and read any of the captions that are within my newly generated video. So now I'm going to go ahead and paste in my script. As you can see, it says create a YouTube short on the best places to visit, add an occasional joke throughout the video and make the video energetic with some tropical music. Very simple, but somewhat detailed. Now you can go to any extent when it comes to being detailed within the script. But for this, I'm very happy. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is, is click generate video. It's then gonna go ahead and analyze my script and start to generate the video. And then you need to fill out some information on your video. So what the audience is catered to. So if it's travel enthusiast, adventure seekers, or what the look and feel is or the platform, I'm pretty happy with how all this looks. So I'll go ahead and click continue. And now after a couple minutes, it has now generated a video with my specifications using my own voice. So I'll go ahead and play the video for you to show you what it looks like. I don't think people understand how amazing these places are. Let's explore and find your next dream destination. First up, Bali. And there we go. Just from inputting a script and recording my own voice, it has now generated a whole minute long video with captions, some cool B-roll, and of course it uses my own voice. And there's plenty more you can do with this. So for example, let's say I wasn't happy with something within the video. I can go ahead and give it a command, such as lower the music a little. Let's say the background music was too loud. I can go ahead and input this command here and click generate. There we go. As you can see, it is now lowered it. So now if I play the video, beaches, temples, and more smoothie bowls than you could ever want. It is now lowered it a little bit. Now let's say I wasn't happy with that change. I can go ahead and simply just undo it like so. And there we go. Now it's back to the original video. Now, probably the most cool thing you can do with this little command area is I can actually change the language spoken within this video. So I can change this to whatever I'd want. So what I'll go ahead and do is type the command here, change the language to Italian. I'll go ahead and click generate. And there we go. So after a few minutes, as you can see, it has now changed not only my voice throughout this video, it's also changed the captions as well. So I'll go ahead and show you what it looks like. 
non credo che le persone capiscano quanto siano incredibili questi posti. Now, of course, I'm not fluent in Italian, so I don't know exactly if this is good. However, it does sound very good. And that's just a start with what you can do with your video. You can generally put whatever you want in this command section and it will change it to whatever you'd like. Now, another great thing you can do is click the little edit option button right here. And then you can go to the actual editing area. So as you can see, it shows all the story blocks or iStock footage that it has for my B-rolls within my clip. So if I go ahead and scroll along, as you can see, it shows all of it. What I can do is actually click the clip which shows and displays each of the captions within that B-roll. I can also go in the top left and choose to edit the script. So if I click edit script, I can scroll down and go through all of my script that I've input. I can change the media, I can add text or even add another speaker. So if I wanted the speaker to change throughout my video, I can do that as well. And you can also do the same for edit music. So if I click edit music, I can change the track that's being played within my video. And for the most part, that is in video. Now, of course, there's no limit to what you can do with NVIDIA. You can generally put whatever commands you want within this little area here and fine tune whatever you want within your video. So if you were happy with how your video was looking, you can go ahead and choose to download the video. So I can click download and then click download video. And then you have a couple options here. So because I do have a paid option, I can choose to have no watermarks and I can choose to remove the AI video branding. So again, I can click none. But if you do not have a plan, which most of you won't, you will be limited to these options such as stock watermarks and you can only use normal. In regards to the download resolution, it is up to you. There is a 4K option, but obviously that is not in use yet. However, this may change when this video is out, so do keep that in mind. But because I have a plan, I'll stick to what I currently had. So no watermarks, no branding, and I'll keep it at 1080p. And then I'll go ahead and click continue. And there we go. Now our video has downloaded and I can now put this to wherever I would like. Now, if you were interested in a plan to unlock some great features within NVIDIA, you can go ahead in the top right and click the upgrade button. You're then taken to the pricing page where there's three options you can choose between. There is the free option, which you will have by default. There is the plus plan, which I do highly recommend, and the max plan. Now, if you were to choose between yearly and monthly, you do save 20% off with yearly. If I do swap it to monthly, it does go up by a little bit. So I do suggest going with the yearly option because you do save some money. But based off most people's situation, the plus plan is definitely the way to go. So hopefully you found some use within this AI video generator tool. Again, the video AI really is a great tool. You can really get specific with what you want and it will produce exactly what you want within a couple minutes. Again, if you were interested in this great tool, there will be a link in the description down below, which you guys can click on. Thanks a lot for watching and I hope to see you guys next time.